Yo, 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 what's going on with y'all? Hope y'all been evoluting, hope y'all been improving, and y'all better. Have it fucking staying zone. But look, I'm bringing some good ass fucking energy to y'all. You feel what I'm saying? I feel really, really good today. You feel what I'm saying? Look. Okay, let me speak on something. Alright. <laughs> Alright, bro, so I seen something today. It kind of caught me off guard and it's like, honestly, for guys, for us guys, we really, really gotta work on ourselves. Really, 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 really got to work on ourselves. Because if we're not working on ourselves constantly and we're not evolving mentally, spiritually, emotionally, physically, you won't be happy. Simple as that. And I have a different perspective on how happiness, how I see it now. Happiness is we put happiness on a fucking pedestal. We want to be happy all the fucking time. But the truth is, we won't be happy all the time. And that's good. And that's fine. When you happy, you need to be sad. And if you're always sad, then you will be happy. At one point. It's all in because we dig our own grave for ourselves. We, keep, we just keep going deeper and deeper. And when we go deeper and deeper, we can't get out of that place. It gets hard. What I'm trying to say is, who gives a fuck if you're not happy all the time? Who gives a fuck, bro? You got to do what the fuck you got to do. Even if you happy, sad... Bruh, man the fuck up, you got to do what you got to do. And honestly, I'm talking to all the guys out there. I'm talking to all the men out there. I'm talking to all the young men, all the young, you know, anybody that watches my video. You have to improve on yourself. Now, a lot of guys, and, I, and, and I'm speaking for guys in general, don't be blind, bro, by these hoes. There's a wifey. And then there's these bitches, bro. The, 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 those are two type of different females. And there's multiple ones, man. There's the alpha bitch. <laughs> bro, there's the gold digger. Uh, there's the attention whore. The reason why you probably feel lonely is because you keep seeking outside validation. That's tough. Speaking to all my guys out there, too. Y'all motherfuckers ugly as fuck, too. Don't get it twisted. But, even if you ugly as fuck, bro, you still gotta fix your stability, your financial. Because, honestly, bro, a lot of girls really, really like the ugly man. I, like, because the girl will date the ugly man because the girl don't want to feel insecure about herself. So, she'll get an ugly boyfriend. But, most of the time, you know, that nigga's probably paying her, uh, her bills... And all that shit. And, uh, you know, beta male provider. I don't know, bro. I came across and I was on Snapchat. I was on Snapchat. And I'm, I'm scrolling across. I see this girl. She's promoting her OnlyFans. But she has her guy in the background. Like, he's laughing. That's her boyfriend. He's letting, the, he, he's letting her show her body. So, I just don't understand that, to be honest. I see some other shit. I, look, no disrespect. But if you've seen this video, you know who you are. Some nigga on fucking Instagram, bro. <sighs> Seen this shit today, bro. It fucking fucked me over. Like, what the fuck, bro? This nigga savage. I don't know if he's savage. I don't know if this nigga beta. I don't know. What the fuck, bro? Let me figure this. What the fuck? All right, so look. This is what it was. Basically, what happened, I'm scrolling and I'm scrolling. Pressing on stories on Instagram. You know how it goes. Boom. Press on his story, you know. It's their six month anniversary, so he's promoting her or whatever, like he's showing her off. Boom, boom, boom. I'll go to the last slide. I'm like, what the fuck? Bruh, I'm like, what the fuck did I just see? She had her neck. <laughs> she had her neck. 
She had his nut in her mouth, bro. <laughs> Off camera, bro. Oh, while he was in the back, he's like, like he just laughing. He's like, I'm like, and then she like she just in the camera like with his nut, bro. Like I'm in the camera on his story. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? All right, I didn't know really what to call that. Like, what is that? Well, that's toxic. You feel what I'm saying? And basically. Don't find yourself in toxic situations. They're draining. Anyways. I will talk to y'all later. Focus on yourself. Work on yourself. And stay. Bye.